Guymon is the largest town in Oklahoma's 6,000 square mile panhandle, and it's home to the Guymon Pioneer Days Rodeo, known as Oklahoma's richest rodeo. Guymon is located in the center of the Oklahoma Panhandle. It's known as No Man's Land. We have over 400 hotel rooms, over 20 restaurants. People like to come and stay here and travel over to Black Mesa. It's also the perfect lodging hub for several very interesting northwestern Oklahoma destinations and an ideal base for exploring the Great Plains Trail of Oklahoma. And the town hosts annually one of the largest motorcycle gatherings in the country. Guymon has no less than 13 parks that cover approximately 160 acres. Thompson Park is an oasis of outdoor activities, providing 50 acres of recreation that contain 13 shelters with 19 picnic tables. The park is situated on the banks of Sunset Lake, a 32-acre lake seasonally stocked with catfish and trout. In the summer, paddle boats are available for rent to the delight of those young and, of course, young at heart. A lighted walking trail as well as a miniature train ride is available on the shore surrounding the lake, making for quite captivating journeys that create fabulous family memories guaranteed to last a lifetime. Offering more golfing days than the state of Arizona, Guymon is home to Sunset Hills Golf Course, one of the premier 18-hole golf courses available in the Oklahoma Panhandle. One of the best golf courses available for hundreds of miles, Sunset Hills provides 160 acres of good fairways and beautiful greens around the adjacent Sunset Lake. Sunset Hill Golf Club is located here in beautiful Guymon, Oklahoma. We are just on the western side of the town, uh, conveniently located just a pitching wedge away from Highway 54. With a USGA course rating of 69, this 6,236 yard par 71 slope 117 course is open year round, seven days a week, with the greens beautifully kept throughout the year with fully irrigated tee boxes and some of the best bent grass in the tri-state area. And most people think that the Panhandle uh, is kind of flat, but out here you'll have a lot of uh, undulation. The greens are uh, very large, a lot of land movement, so you'll have uh, some pretty nice elevation changes, approach shots up to the greens and then down to greens, so you'll be needing to uh, change your yardages as you approach to some of these greens. We are a host site for the Jim Hitch Memorial Tournament. A local family puts this on every year in June. Uh, what they've done is they've been able to uh, make it a qualifier site for other large events such as the AJGA, the North Texas PGA, and a couple other uh, large tournaments. Green fees are low and tee times are available without advance notice, while the people are friendly and the environment is very relaxing. Production values of both the rodeo and the PBR have really changed in the last 20 years. Now we have high volume, high energy music, we're very choreographed, it happens very fast. So if you went to a rodeo 20 years ago, it was kind of a long drawn out, kind of a relaxed affair, but now it's really, you know, America's extreme sport, the original one, uh, and we've got all the production to go with it.
the difference between PBR and the PRCA or a regular rodeo is it's a hundred percent bull riding. The original concept was the best bull riders and the best bulls. They have full surpassed what they had originally intended to do uh, with the way the stock contractors have bred the bulls. Uh, tonight in Gaiman we have got 43 of the best bull riders in the world and I've got 50 of the best bulls in the world coming to Gaiman. The energy of the fans at a PBR event is is like something you can't really describe. They're all happy that you rode a ranked bull and they're just super pumped up to be there and it's it's something I can't explain. I just love it when, when we actually pack the stands out and have a good turnout. According to their slogan, this is the place where the West is still wild. We call Guyman Oklahoma's richest rodeo because not only do we have the biggest purse as far as prize money, but we have over 900 contestants and we have the best fans and sponsors. So really rich in tradition, rich in production, rich in competition. We are truly Oklahoma's richest rodeo. Located in Oklahoma's Panhandle, close to the tri-state border with Colorado and New Mexico, Black Mesa State Park and Black Mesa Natural Preserve both take their name from the layer of black lava rock that coated the mesa about 30 million years ago. Visitors to this geologically fascinating destination can hike to the top of the plateau in the Black Mesa Nature Preserve, operated by the Oklahoma Tourism and Recreation Department in conjunction with Black Mesa State Park, the Nature Preserve consists of approximately 1,600 acres where visitors can not only hike, but enjoy 23 rare plants and eight rare animal species. You can visit petrified dinosaur tracks and actually touch them, walk around them. You can go to the Tri-State Marker and stand in Colorado, New Mexico, and Oklahoma all at once. Set within the Black Mesa State Park, Lake Carl Etling offers approximately 159 surface water acres and five miles of shoreline. The park also provides 36 RV sites with water and electric hookups, as well as 23 tent sites on a first-come, first-served basis. Camping facilities include showers, playgrounds, picnic areas, and group facilities. This is primarily a fishing lake with boat ramps on the east and south sides of the lake but with no water sport activities allowed. So, as you just saw, Gaiman has a lot to offer and can be the perfect lodging hub when traveling through the vast and peaceful Oklahoma Panhandle area. <laughs>